Good morning. The Chinese market manufacturing PMI fell to 49.2 in August, fell into the contraction region, which was the first time since April 20, 2020. Premier Li Keqiang announced to provide further 300 billion RMB loan quota for SME, as well as increase the insurance of local government, government bond to boost investment. Thanks to the policy support, Hong Kong stock is expected to remain firm today. Hansen index support will be 25,700 points, which is the yesterday low. Hong Kong stock connects net outflow shrink to $116 million on Wednesday, of which Tencent reversed recent net sales and recorded a net inflow of $1,180 million. On the other hand, Enter 2020 suffered another net outflow of $386 million. Tencent continued to perform well in the U.S. ADL market last night. However, 50-day moving average, which is around $505, remains a major resistance in the short term. Besides China's increase in fiscal policy support, funds flowed into infrastructure, construction, and cement stocks in the past two trading days. Related stocks will remain the short-term focus. For the stock pack today, Galaxy Entertainment 27, Macau Casino Gross Gaming Revenue was MOP 4.4 billion in August, up 234% year on year, but down 47% month on month. Macau's GGL data beat market expectation of MOP 3.5 billion. Macau eased mobility and broader measures in mid-August, and the number of visitors in Macau has rebounded. As pandemic in China has been under control, cross-border traveling is expected to recover. Looking ahead, September average daily GGL forecast has been raised from MOP 140 million to MOP 200 and 250 million. Given its strong balance sheet, we suggest to accumulate Galaxy Entertainment as a defensive play compared with peers. In terms of valuation, its 12-month forward EV over EBITDA is 18 times close to the three-year historic average. Our target price is $60. Cut loss is 44 Thank you.